everyone, this is Music Tech Help Guy, and welcome to another episode of Free Plugin Weekly. Today we're checking out another Air Windows plugin called Console 5. Now, what Console 5 is, is it's actually a set of three different plugins. Um, the first one is called Console 5 Channel, there's Console 5 Dark Channel, and there's Console 5 Bus. Now, the point of console is to mimic the saturation and sort of beef and heft that you get from mixing on an actual uh, analog console. So it injects a little bit of analog warmth and just and flavor into your mixes. And the way it does it is you have to use one of the two channel plugins in um, tandem with the bus plugin. Essentially, the two channel plugins saturate the channels. They saturate the channels in your mix. And then what you do is you put the bus plugin on your master output or your master bus in your mix, and it desaturates uh, the signal. And what this does is it creates not like a like a super drastic change in your mix, but enough for it to be viable. And, and I've said this about Air Windows plugins before, a lot of them are, they do one sort of niche thing very well, and the Console 5 plugin does this very well. It's a nice, just sort of slight, just not softening, but just warming uh, plugin, and also just gives it a little bit more beef and heft at the same time. Not only is it warming it, it's also saturating it. So what I've done in my mix is on all of my actual audio or MIDI channels, I've put the uh, Console 5 channel plugin. Um, there is an input pad on it, but I'm basically just gonna leave that alone. And then on my master output, I have added the Console 5 bus plugin. So again, saturating in all the channels and then desaturating on the master output. Now, I'm not really sure if this is intended to be put on summing stacks and aux tracks. Um, I'll do another example after this where I put it on pretty much all uh, the channel version of it on all of the tracks. But right now, you're only hearing console 5 channel just on actual tracks, not on summing stacks, not on aux tracks. What I'm going to do is, uh, and by the way, I've put it as the last thing on the, on each of my audio channels. Uh, what I'm going to do is play a little bit of this tune, and then uh, what I'll do is I'll bypass back and forth with uh, console in and uh, with, then with console out. So I'll start with console out, and I'll kick it in and out a few times so we can A-B it. So there you go. That's basically what it does. It's uh, it's just adds a bit of analog color into your in the box digital mixes. It's not a huge drastic change. I'd say it's about a five percent change, but it's good enough of a change that I, I really enjoy using this. All right, so let's try this again. Uh, what I've done differently this time is I've added the console five plugin to all of my aux channels. Um, like, for instance, I've got uh, like an ensemble chorus effect for my vocals and some reverb here. Um, I've also added it to all of my summing stacks as well. So it's on my uh, guitar solo stack. It's on my uh, lead vocal uh, stack. So let's see if uh, doing this, we get even more of a little more drastic effect. So really what this plugin does well is it just helps to make completely digital mixes have a little bit of that analog oomph. Like before I add in the console uh, 5 plugin, it doesn't sound bad, but it's just, it's a little gritty, it's a little grainy, it's a, it's just a little bit harsh sounding, and you kick in that console plugin, and again, it's not night and day, but it, it does improve it and give it more of a round uh, sound. All right, so one last example here. Um, this time, instead of using the uh, console channel, I'm using the console dark channel. So let's see if we get an even warmer effect out of this.
Let's move over to an area where there's like a lot of high frequency content, or like over here in the guitar solo, and let's uh, A-B that as well. All right, guys, so that is the Console 5 plugin from Air Windows. It's a free plugin. Go check it out at airwindows.com. Chris from Air Windows is a great guy. He puts out all sorts of these just interesting niche plugins. He gives them away for free, and basically all he does is ask that you contribute to his uh, Patreon uh, account, and that's that's awesome that he's doing that. So so he's basically keeping uh, Air Windows alive just completely with Patreon subscriptions. So go check him out. Um, give him a, a Patreon a donation if you feel the need to, and if you feel feel like his plugins are useful to you. But again, you know, console, it it's a great plugin to kind of put like that last little bit of varnish or a little bit of just, it's almost like putting a, a little bit of gloss over the mix, if you know what I mean. Um, it's a great plugin to sort of start off with too, you know, you can put it on all of your channels and as you're mixing, you're, you're mixing under the console plugin. Again, using console to sort of emulate the uh, the analog sound and mix under the console plugin rather than, you know, doing what I did here and adding it later. All right, guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any ideas for any future free plugin weekly topics, let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.